to my late, latest project. I did the Aquamist installation on this car. Uh, I got the gauge up here on the dash, and I put the fuel injector amplifier box here under the little uh, eyeglass holder compartment on the center console. Uh, what we're going to do is I have water in the gauge now, and we're going to uh, base run the Stage 1 Evo 9 with uh, pump gas at 20 pounds of boost and then what we're going to do is we're going to turn on we'll, we'll baseline it with the Aquamesh system turned off then then after that we're going to uh, activate the system and then we'll do the next run with the water on and see what difference in power just water injection makes just from the cooling of the charge without any tuning just just uh, as a uh, test then of course we're going to put the uh, denatured alcohol in the tank and turn the boost up in tune and we should make a lot more power. Alright, so our base pull was on this beautiful Evo 9 stage 1 was with a dyno flash base tune 290 horsepower 291 torque at 20 pounds of boost. That was with no water or alcohol injection whatsoever. Now we are going to turn on the Aquamist that has some water in the tank and we're going to spray some water and we will observe to see if the car makes any additional power I'm curious because I've never done 100% water injection before let's see what happens to the power figure jumping to straight water and we lost power we lost power just using just water oh, we don't like water it seemed to have been uh, maybe it's too much water it seemed to have been uh, misfiring and breaking up so what we're going to do now is we're going to remove that water from the tank and we're going to put alcohol in there okay so we didn't like the water now we filled the tank up with uh, some denatured alcohol. And then we're going to tune it with alcohol and see uh, where we get. We were at 290. Uh, this is a stage one car. I like to see the car make about uh, 320 wheel horsepower on this pusher dyno, which would probably be about 350, 360 on a dyno jet. We'll see what happens. Uh, FIA2 fuel injection amplifier uh, that shows the flickering of your. Your fuel injector pulse, and then uh, when the red light comes on spring, you have your gauge that shows the amount of flow. And we're going to do a pull here. The car's starting to make some more power, man. Okay, so we're starting to make a little progress with the alcohol injection. We're up to about 27, 28 pounds of boost uh, on pump gas. Uh, the car is not knocking at all. The aqu Aquamist is working fantastically with 100% denatured alcohol. We're going to do a pull here in third. Uh, the car is tuned very well. I think we're about done. See what kind of numbers we come up with here. Wow. Wow, that's incredible, man. This is just a, a Evo 9 with stage one. We got 341 torque and 324 wheel horsepower up from 290, 290. So those are some pretty respectable gains. 35 horsepower and about 50 foot pounds of torque increase with just a very conservative tune. The boost is touching 27 and uh, the air fuel very conservative and the car not knocking at all. Pretty nice upgrade. I'm a big fan of uh, Aquamist if you couldn't tell by now.